For this lesson, we're going to complete your bathroom. We're going to zoom up in the upper left corner of your cabin. The utilities that are going to go into a full size bathroom include a tub, a toilet, and a lavatory or a bathroom sink that fits, in our case, into a vanity. Those items can be found in the content browser. If I single left click on the content browser and go back to my design tool catalog Imperial, and it's in an odd spot, but if you go into mechanical, your plumbing fixtures are there. Single left click, and you can see there's bath items. There's the lavatory or the sinks. These sinks are for your kitchen. We'll revisit that later, and you can see that there's a toilet there. We're going to single left click in the bath, and you can see there's two pages of utilities. The tub, the 30 inch by 60 inch, will fit in our five foot opening on the back side of the wall perfectly and select insert into drawing. For now, we're just going to put it out on the screen and then select escape. We're going to go back and bring out all your utilities first. Back up, back up, back up. And we're going to go to toilet. And we can just simply pick either tank one or tank two standards. Single left click and escape. The vanity with the laboratory itself, if we back up or go back into mechanical and go into plumbing fixtures, we can go into laboratory. And there's three pages. A lot of them are 2D, but we're going to use this vanity here. Hover over it, insert into drawing, and escape. All these items are referenced as the plumbing needs to go through the wall on this side, this side, and this side. We're going to turn them all around. If we select in our modify panel, you're going to see a little kind of arrow swooping, which means rotate. If I single left click on rotate, and I select the item. In this case, I want to single left click on the tub anywhere. Now that I'm done selecting the tub, I want to select the enter key on the keyboard. Enter. Now it wants me to pick a base point. In this case, it really doesn't matter. I'm going to pick it up at this corner, click, and flip it around by means of moving my cursor. Once I see a green line lock in, I'm going to left click and drop it. Now my faucet's over here. In the same manner, I'm going to do that to my toilet. Single left click on rotate, left click on my item, select enter, select the base point. I'm going to click on the back of the tank, left click, and drag it around. Left click. Rotate, vanity. Enter, left click, and left click. Now they're all facing the correct way. In our bathroom, this area is 5 feet by 8 feet. That's 40 square feet. And this is the minimum size bathroom that you can have to fit all utilities safely and spacing to have consideration for a full-size bath. Now, to move these in right next to rotate is our move. We need to anticipate our move. I'm going to eventually, after I hit move and so on, I'm going to click on this corner so I can put it on this corner. So I'm going to select move, and I'm going to select the tub. And I'm going to select enter. And I'm going to pick it up at the corner, left click. Placing it, left click. For the toilet, there's small little nodes just outside of the item. I'm going to single click so they highlight a little bit clearer. Select escape. Those nodes are
bar 15 inches from the center of the tank over. That is the minimum distance required to place a toilet next to a wall, in this case, a bathtub, and also our vanity. To activate those nodes or to pick them up, we need to come to the bottom and you'll see a square with a little square. These are your snap cursor settings. Next to it is one of those triangles. If I left click on the triangle, you're gonna see that there's going to be a node. If it's unchecked, we need to activate it by checking that node. Now I can simply left click my screen to get rid of this. Come up to move, select my toilet, select enter, pick it up at a node. And I'm gonna pick it up at this top one and put it by the top. It makes sense to not have this tank right next to the top. You do need that distance. I'm going to move my vanity, enter. I'm gonna pick it up at the bottom right corner and put it in the bottom. I'm gonna select my toilet and I'm just gonna show you that right there's the node so I do have a safe distance between those items. That is your completed bathroom with all fixed utilities in it. Double click.